Hey, Bruce, I came as soon as you called. What, what's going on? Oh, hey, Clark. It's, uh, just this little thing that, that I found that I thought it'd be fun to uh, share with the group. Don't you think, Arthur? Do we really need to do this, man? Like, seriously? No, 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 no. It's funny. Come on. Okay, is one of you going to explain what the fuck is going on? Bruce, I said I'd stop. Do we really need to do this right now? Absolutely, we need to fucking do this. So Tim was on the internet the other day, and he, uh... What the hell is that? <laughs> Well, he found a little, a little something, something. Okay, I'm scared to ask, but what did he find? Is this really necessary? Absolutely. He found that. Arthur, what the fuck is that? It's nothing. Arthur, what the fuck is that? Yeah, Arthur, what the fuck is that? It's nothing. It don't look like nothing. It looks like a thing of salt water. Sea water, to be precise. Look, being a lighthouse keeper doesn't pay what he used to, okay? It's just a silly brand of fish aqua bath water. So what the fuck? Look, man, tattoos aren't free. Hey, Tim. So, You know how you found Aquaman's bathwater online the other day? <laughs> yeah, you know, that shit's hilarious, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, bro, super funny. Um, how the fuck did you find that? What do you mean? I mean that that's not something you just stumble across on Amazon. To find weird shit like that, you need to, uh, you need to be looking. What's your search history look like, Tim? That is none of your fucking business. You stay the fuck away from my computer! Sometime later. Hey guys, I'm back from my date with Corey. What? What's, uh... What's up with Jason? He looked at my search history. Oh my god, why would you let him do that? That shit's what made Azriel start killing people! Look, I fucking warned him! There are things in this world human eyes are not meant to gaze upon. Hey guys, how's it going? Whoa, what's, uh, what's up with Jason? The dumbass looked at my search history. Oh shit, really? Let me see. No, save the child! Oh please, it can't possibly be that god is dead and this was the wedding. Okay, but like, could you fucking imagine that? That's OJ Simpson, if I did it, levels of fucking hilarious. Hey, Bruce. What is it, Jason? I'm very busy. Oh, no, don't, don't worry. This is, uh, super quick. Just, just one question. Fine. Yeah, one question. What's up? Yeah, um, what the fuck? Yeah, it's an encyclopedia on how to be Batman that I wrote. What about it? No, it's an encyclopedia on Batman that you fucking published, Bruce. Yeah, exactly. It's the perfect cover. Oh. Really? Please, do tell! I am very fascinated to hear your reasoning here. No one would think that Batman would be stupid enough to publish an encyclopedia about himself with his secret identity's pen name. Come on. You're very right. I didn't think you were that stupid either until I read the fucking thing. Oh, come on. You're being overdramatic. If I was Batman, which I'm not, I promise I would hide the secret entrance to the Batcave behind the waterfall under Wayne Manor. I don't see your point here. Alfred now has more confirmed kills than Riddler because of that shit. I mean, that's pretty low bar, but... Oh, fuck! fuck. Do you think it was weird the first time that the Robins went on a mission with Red Hood? Not even because of all the times he tried to kill them, more so because of, like, his methods? Even if he's not using live rounds, like, think of what that would be like. Hey man, I am starving. You feeling hungry? You wanna get some Big Belly Burger after this? Yeah, Jason, whatever. Will you shut up? We need to find Mothman, okay? You need to find Mothman. I need to find the fucking cider fries. <laughs> Jesus, son of a bitch! Oh, Red Boys, you found my secret lair, but you are too late! Right, Jason, you ready to do this? Yeah. You could say that. I don't ever be able to find all the hostages in time. Is that a Glock 19? Yup. <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah, one sec. Still breathing, Mothman? Oh god. Yup. <laughs> Alright, uh, you ready for burgers? Oh, well, I don't know. Do you think you fucking got him? You know what? Let me check real quick. For fuck's sake! Bullshit. Nah, man, I'm being completely serious. Absolute fucking bullshit. Hey, you can believe whatever the fuck you want. Your life is not nearly as fucked up as mine. It 100% is, if not worse. I dress up in fucking spandex like a giant flying rodent to kick the shit out of the mentally ill because my parents were gunned down in front of me when I was fucking eight. Okay, but be that as it may, my adopted son was beaten within an inch of his life and then blown the fuck up because of a mistake that I made by my greatest enemy. Okay, yeah, but I have had to go through the trauma of each one of my children dying at least once. I have to put up with all of your bullshit. Hmm. I am a career detective with two children. One of them is a fucking serial killer, and the other one is a goddamn vigilante! I mean, I can understand how that would be pretty hard. Oh yeah, when you decided to become an amnesiac botanist, I had to get this fucking haircut, don a bunny suit, and do your fucking job for a month! Okay, I get it!
Oh, come on, now don't you stop. Heroes don't do that? Look, it wasn't my fucking work. Heroes don't do that. I never fucking said- You could have gone with any reasoning, and the one you went with is heroes don't do that. Well, it's not exactly like I had a choice in the matter. Bro, I am literally made of steel. Not a single part of me bends. I can stop a bullet with any part of my body, and I have been faithfully married for multiple years. How the fuck do you think that is, Mr. Heroes don't do that? I didn't fucking need to know that. Your cowl literally has hair for this specific reason! Now I know for a fact that you did not just call the ears of my cow handles! Is this why your love interest is a fucking revolving door? Because you don't give back to the fucking community? And then you follow it up by calling all of my exes a fucking community. H how many people have seen this? No exaggeration? Yeah, everyone. For fuck's sake. Literally everyone. No one's gonna be riding the bat pole for a while. Will you please shut up? I cannot fucking believe that. God. Hey, hon. Hey, Smallville. Oh, hey, how was your talk with Bruce? Oh, Lois, you know him. He's Batman. He didn't confirm or deny anything, and then he kicked me out. Yeah, yeah, no, that definitely sounds like him. Why'd you go and talk to him again? Uh, well, you know, there's this article going around that Batman is, um, is selfish? I don't know if I particularly call him selfish. In, uh, in bed? Oh. Oh. Oh, you mean like he doesn't... On his- on his partner? Yeah, yeah, that. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, I know, right? Turns out it's bullshit, though, completely fake. Oh, yeah, I know. Oh, good, so you, uh, you already talked to Selena then? Why, did she say something about it? Yeah, no, had a whole press release, told everybody there was total bullshit. Oh, good for her. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, night, Smallville. Yeah, good night, Lois. Wait a minute, what the fuck do you mean you know? What? What are you talking about? If you didn't talk to Selena yet, how the fuck did you know that wasn't true? Now just hold on a minute. You know what, I just remembered I forgot something to Bruce's place. I'll be right back. Wait, fuck, Clark! Hey, guys, so, what'd you, uh, get Bruce for Father's Day? Oh, hey, Barbara, you know, no, nothing too serious. Yeah, you know, no, nothing much. Just some the regular, normal Father's Day stuff. Yeah, what Drake said. Y'all got him a bunch of fucked up shit, didn't you? I bought him a lifetime supply of children's pants in exactly the size I was when I was robbing. Okay. I didn't even fucking use the Wayne credit card. I have no idea how I'm gonna financially recover from this, but it was fucking worth it. I bought him a spare tire. Okay, I guess it's not that bad. I also stole two of them off the Batmobile. And there's the Jason Todd I know. Really? Guys, come on, that shit's just rude. Well, what did you get him, Drake? Hmm? Oh, I got him a buy three, get the fourth one free coupon for the adoption agency taped inside of a disguise book for dummies. What the fuck? They sell those? Yeah, they're like these yellow books. They got a funny little character on the front of them usually. I obviously meant the coupon! Oh, no, not at all. That'd be fucked up. But as soon as I mentioned I was a Wayne, they gave me options. That makes a scary amount of sense. What about you, Damien? What'd you get? A literal fucking pallet of bird cages. What the fuck? You know, because he collects robins. <sighs> oh, hey, morning, Bruce. How was your, uh, how was your Father's Day? Clark, you've met my kids, right? I just asked you how your Father's Day went. So yeah, yeah, I met your kids. So how the fuck do you think it went? They got you a bunch of fucked up shit, didn't they? Yeah, went a little something like this. Dick? Yes, Bruce? Is this a lifetime supply of children's pants? Oh, you know, it's just there in case you, uh, forget to give them to your next Robin again. Are you ever gonna let me live down that fucking costume? No, not in the slightest. Yeah, no, that spare tire was actually really sweet and sentimental of you, Jason. Thank you, I appreciated it a lot. Yeah, I'll talk to you later. All right, love you too. Bye. And this motherfucker stole two of my tires. This son of a bitch. This all makes way more sense now. Oh, haha, ha, Tim. Disguises for dummies. Yeah, I get it. What is this? Is this a coupon? Adopt three, get the fourth one free. Is this real? Don't fuck around with me. I'll use this shit. Is this real? Alpha, call the guy. We need four more. Damien, you know I don't collect actual birds, right? Did you just admit to the robins being a collection? Now, you know that's not what I fucking meant. Uh, Doc, can you please uh, turn and state your name for the camera? Yeah, sure. Uh, my name is Dr. Morton. I am a uh, level 2 medical officer at Arkham Asylum. Do I really need to talk to the camera? Essentially, my job is to be the general care physician for all of the super criminals housed at the asylum. So you're basically just a normal doctor. Uh, how hard can that be? I'm sorry, how hard can that be? No, no, no. Uh, Tell me how many eye drops that you think that Two Face goes through in a week just to make sure that this one doesn't turn into a fucking raisin. Do you have any clue how long and how many materials it takes to splint? The runway that Penguin calls a nose? I'm gonna be honest with you, I've never seen Clayface shit. Ever. I'm starting to worry that that's what he's fucking made of. Hey, eight goddamn years of medical school with a minor in psychology only to spend my fucking days fixing the grill of a misogynistic clown and reassuring him that, in fact, 
washing his ass will not and cannot make him gay. Him wanting to get positively railed by Batman might be a different story, but still. So do you like your job? Oh yeah, totally. So that will be about it for this month. Thank you everybody for watching. I just want to take a second to thank all of my lovely generous patrons. Yaoi Nichan, Magu, Brandon Laney, Cassie Pace, Fancy Man, Cat Stevens, Linda Mackert, Pandora A, Raven Ash 260, Tarara, Theresa Harrison, Virgil, Great Nerd Beard, Danny Girl, Caitlin Ween, Katrina Spoor, The Brain Teaser, Quiet Knoll, Briar Rabbit, Danny Walker, Draven Miller, Dustin Brothers, Christina Odd, Lily Kep, Michael Rowe, Michael Sandler, Misty, Puppercut, Sarah Wilmot, Scott Jackson, and Susan Weiner. Thank you all so very much, and I will see you next time.